okay uh death and uh and sometimes um you know like death of a parent and um and what if there's baggage there you know that's not been resolved um so what are my thoughts on that um so within the illusion i i believe in everything is orchestrated perfectly at all times nothing happens by accident and the relationships are not by accident and the wounds are not by accident uh, they offer opportunities for spiritual growth and forgiveness and letting go and and for the invitation of love um so um the ego wants to hang on to resentment pain grievance uh older wounds um and um <clears throat> and so that stuff i mean it, it, if it's active you know um then it, it creates um so you know the uh, the death brings um opportunity to do the spiritual work now um and uh what will i'd say with that is um because all that happens at the end of the day when someone's dying is um either there's complete love and and, and love orchestrates or or the, the 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 wounds the resentments the grievances the unforgiveness um will limit the capacity for for love in that situation and complete healing often when there, it's a, a, a an important relationship whether it was good or bad uh it brings up you know obviously it, it is a an opportunity for extreme spiritual growth for you uh, who's going through that to uh, do the forgiveness god is alone which i forgive or cancellations or allowing the feelings um or getting help or going to groups to help with the forgiveness and the letting go or even the even grief you know it can be grief for the person going away or the grief that they weren't what you want or the grief that one didn't have the relationship that was wanted you know or all kinds of griefs and 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 emotions may come up at such a time so um just to allow those uh, or to forgive those or to be with those and you know um for me the thing then is you see if um, if if there isn't just the absolute presence of love is what's coming up what thoughts are coming up what feelings are coming up that's the work you see um and um some things i could do i mean even if i had to be around someone who's dying who i had baggage with is i could probably sit there and do the prayers in my head silently and clear up what's coming up like i remember what you said to me when i was five years old but i can forgive that in my head uh and or if i can't go to them i could still be forgiving them in my room at home uh as all this stuff is coming uh so i would every thought that comes up any anger any any feelings to um to um uh just uh cancel or use a course lesson or observe or just allow the feelings and um yeah and, and great healing now on another level um yeah you see um just um uh share again the story of dr hugh len um and just the power of forgiveness or letting go so dr hugh len is what i call a mystic who was given as i understand it and i'm not and i don't claim to be an expert given the files of the prisoners in a hawaiian prison in the u.s and he didn't actually meet the prisoners he just got the file like this guy is uh this guy likes to run over children this guy likes to beat people with a with an axe so all these people were in prison i think for serious offenses and he forgave them all just by reading the files of what they did you know he mystically um did the letting go forgiveness uh he called it transcending the data letting go of all the story um so and everyone in that prison actually got well and the, they closed the prison down so that's the power of forgiveness so what I'm saying with that, it doesn't only free the person who forgives, but it also frees the people who are being forgiven, because there's great, um, you know, especially with um, a, a close relationship, 
There's great baggage on both sides. So to forgive is releasing oneself and the other person from um, limited ideas that bind both into the world of illusion. So um, anyway, um, I've been through the death of both my parents and um, um, yeah, you know, I, what I'd say from my, my experience was I, I wanted to be of maximum love and I wanted to clear the baggage because I knew that love would not just help me, but it would help them in their transition uh, you know, to be there. Um, I didn't want to give them more guilt and more fear and more problems. I wanted to be at the highest vibration as they passed so that they could, um, they could transition to the next, uh, the next, uh, realm. Okay. So I'll stop there.